Welcome to Enchanted Tarot. Before I begin, I would like to say thank you to everyone who has liked, shared, subscribed, and who has donated to this channel. Also, thank you to everyone who has purchased a reading with me. This is for the sign of Taurus for the first half of May, or from the time you view this video, these events could be in play. Please keep in mind, it is a general reading. That means it will, not, uh, it will not resonate with each and every one of you who are watching. These messages are only for a specific few of you. Um, whoever this is for, um, this is somebody that you had released. I feel that you will get news from this person. Now, from what I can see, in the past, it lacked a foundation. Um, <clears throat> you could have felt as though you were dealt a poisoned apple by this person. This person, <clears throat> excuse me, this person would have been uh, very charming, very um, sensual. Um, but you, you may have felt as though it was like empty words, empty promises. And I feel like this could have been a third party uh, because you see in this, um, in this picture here that one cup is set aside on the ground. So, you know, maybe you were that third party or they were. I mean, you know, you could have chosen someone else over them or they chose someone else over you. Um, but it came to an end, but the connection was still there. We have this card of, of, um, incompatibility. Okay. So maybe you, it's, that's like being different as day and night, but you still, you can see the connection. They hold hands. You might have had different beliefs or um, you may have, may have felt like they didn't understand you um, or um, you, you just you just weren't on the same page. So it came to an end. You may have withdrew into your pain. Um, this, for some, someone, this happened just last fall. And I, I feel I have to mention that. So, um, you're going to hear from this person again. Um, I feel, um, You're going to hear from them and it's like they're wishing for something more. So they want some type of relationship with you. They could still be married. But you, you're going to get news from them. And you're like, oh, should I? Shouldn't I? <clears throat> and this is with regards to a new opportunity, which is what they are wishing for. And this is also a card that can indicate an invitation. So there could be an invitation um, from this person to meet up because it's also a card of uh, socializing. So a new opportunity for a new beginning. This is somebody you're very connected to because this is the card of Twin Flame. Um, should I, shouldn't I, um, maybe it's a bad idea. Maybe I should just walk away from this. But yet on the other side, we see you reaching for it. Um, so it could be though that should I reach for it or should I walk away? And it's like you're torn here you have this very confident looking person but when she looks in the mirror she's she's in that eight of swords energy so she's 
uh, like in this mental prison, but it doesn't show on the outside. And why is she so uh, full of fear and anxiety? It has to do with that meeting. It has to do with something this person has told them. Because this is the uh, Three of Shields. And in this card, you, it's I call it my seeker card. And this person comes forward seeking this person's understanding, seeking their forgiveness, or maybe even seeking another chance. perhaps offering to clear up any confusion. This King of Swords is reaching for the for that sword. He doesn't hold it yet, but you can see the color of the clouds. And, you know, there's a lot of clouds. They're very thick and they're very um, gray. So um, grabbing that sword, um, speaking their truth or getting to the truth, uh, cutting through the confusion, clearing it up. And maybe you have a lot of confused uh, uh, feelings, a lot of, with regards to this person who has come towards you, with regards to the words spoken. So you have a lot of fears about whether you should accept whatever it is they told you, whether you should um, give them this chance or not, whether you should take this opportunity or not. Should I? Shouldn't I? What do I do? Should I put the effort into this or shouldn't I? And here in your outcome, it's actually quite positive because we have the sun, which brings in that clarity with regards to this king being in reverse. So this has to do with feelings uh, that were kept hidden. So. I feel like it's possible he's going to speak his truth about how he really feels in order to bring balance here because we have the Ace of Cups, so this has to do uh, with his feelings. And a new offer. And the Sun is very positive. And it, actually the Sun is, uh, it is the Yes card. So I feel like with the regards to this decision, you're going to be um, accepting this offer for whoever this is for. So I thank you for, um, for watching. I wish you all the best and many blessings to you. Bye for now.